Hello, hello, Guardians. I am Ransom Rider, and today I'm in the Destiny Cookbook. Uh, it's not going to be a big meal. There's no meals on the table. This is just the boozy edition of the Destiny Cookbook. You've seen me make some other drinks. Now I'm going to be moving on to another drink in the cookbook. And Guardians, this is a treat. This is a real treat. This celebrates an old friend, a past friend, who hopefully we will meet again. Uh, this is in celebration of Cade, Cade 6. We're going to be making today Ace of Spades. I'm excited. Join me as we take this journey making Ace of Spades. Let's grab the Destiny cookbook. I am working from the official cookbook for Destiny. Destiny, the official cookbook by Victoria Rosenthal. Now, I've had a lot of fun working through this uh, with you guys because you're important to me. We get to hang out during my live streams, and I enjoy getting to see each and every one of you in-game. It's a ton of fun for me. It's a lot of fun. I'm seeing places I would have never seen, right? And I hope you are too. Okay, Ace of Spades. Difficulty easy. Prep time 10 minutes. Yield. This is one drink. One drink. And I have to say, 10 minutes? Yes, because some of the other drinks have been like six hours overnight the next day. Uh, luckily, this is one we can start and get completed fairly quickly, 10 minutes. Ace of Spades. Here we go. This recipe is reminiscent of the bright green non-alcoholic libation I often caught Cade Six drinking at a nearby bar. Libation, word of the day. This drink is a little something I concocted to honor our lost friend, though I've added a little extra punch to this version. What's the punch? What is the extra punch? And what could be a better name than his trusty sidearm, Ace of Spades? All right, here's the ingredients in case you're making this at home. Three ounces of melon liquor, liqueur, one ounce of white rum, one ounce of orange liqueur, two ounces of pineapple juice, one half ounce lime juice, one half ounce lemon juice. Fill, here's the instructions. I mean, she's explicit. This is explicit. Fill a cocktail shaker with ice and add all the ingredients. Shake thoroughly. Fill a highball glass with ice and pour the drink. This is amazing. I can't believe my eyes. How easy is this going to be? Okay, three ounces of melon liquor, one ounce of white rum. Okay, melon liquor. Uh, I do believe this is melon liquor. It says melon on it, so I'm going to take their word for it. This is melon liquor. Does it smell like melons? Not really, not really, but maybe it tastes like melons. All right, now I do have, I pre-squeezed some lemon juice. You know, I have my lemons here. Fresh, big old, yummy lemons. I love lemons in my green tea. If you hang out with me, I drink green tea with a lot of lemon, right? Okay, double bag it. Okay, so how much lemon juice did I need? One half ounce lemon juice. I have it here. Let's pop it in there. One half ounce. And then I need three ounces of lemon liqueur. Now, I think this is two ounces. It says two ounces. So let's do this. Two ounces. And then, uh, you know, where is the one out? Why don't they put these measurements on the outside? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to write somebody outside. We, I need it outside. So I, I think this is, I've got an audience and they're, they're drinkers. They're telling me, flip it over, Ransom. All right, so this is one ounce. Is this what this is? One ounce. One half ounce, three fourths ounce, one ounce. So I need one more ounce of melon liquor. Uh, you know, if it's a little bit over, that's okay. All right, that's in. It's in. Let's put this back in because I don't want to drop this. You know, this is so pretty. I feel like Christmas. Put some glitter on it. It's Christmas. Okay, three ounces of melon liquor. You're in there. One ounce of white rum. Okay, this is Bacardi. 
And let's try it. I need one ounce of white rum, one ounce, voila. In it goes. It sounds like a waterfall. I'm liking it. So we got the white rum, the melon liquor, one ounce of orange liquor. Let's get another one ounces of the orange liquor in. Might as well top it off, right? Don't be stingy. All right, how does that smell? Oh man, this smells like oranges. Uh, you know, that smells like oranges. So, and this is sake. That's, this is not good. Sake's not going in this one. This is another video, another drink. You'll have to check that one out around here somewhere because I made a phenomenal Izanagi burden drink with sake. This is from Japan, the real deal. All right, so we've got the melon liquor, the white rum, the orange liquor, two ounces of pineapple juice. Okay, now I have some pineapple juice here. Let's get two ounces. One, two, pineapple juice. There you go. Two ounces of pineapple. And I had a little left over. I love pineapple juice. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. One half ounce lime juice. So uh, I did put what in? I put the lemon juice in. So now I need the lime juice. Let's toss a few of the limes into the press. And I need one half ounce. So this is one ounce, so I need half of this. Oh, I need a little bit more. I'm being exact. I'm being, ex this is a science. Uh, uh, the bartenders, they're scientists, right? They, they have to mix this science-wise. Now, is that gonna be enough? Let me check it. I want to be precise. You know, if this tastes horrible, I can say I followed the instructions exactly, Guardians. And let me know if you make these at home. When you're, when you're entertaining with your gamer buddies, uh, what are you drinking? What are you drinking? Okay, I got it. In it goes. Now, fill the cocktail shaker with ice. Add the ingredients. Shake thoroughly. Fill the glasses with ice. Let's put a little ice in here. It's one drink. This, this was one drink, right? All right, now that's in. Let's put this, let's get some ice in here. We want this to be cold. I want it to be cold. All right, in it goes. It's already chilling down, I can feel it. Pop that, shake, shake, shake. I'm told that a good drink, it's all in the shake. It's all in the shake. Now pop this off. Oh, there it goes. All right. <laughs> that was rough. That was like a Grandmaster Nightfall rough. All right, I'm gonna put this little strainer on top. Shake it up. Pour in the drink. All right, I wanna save room. I know, you know, I have friends that say, don't waste any space on a garnish, right? But I want to put a little garnish in. A little garnish. Some lime. Now, let's taste as this. This is Ace of Spades. Oh, Guardians. Man, I'm not even, you know, a drinker. Like, I, you know, sweet tea is a splurge for me. Ah, this is absolutely delicious. <laughs> I'm loving it. I'm loving it. This is the Ace of Spades, Guardians. If you're using the Ace of Spades in, in game, good for you. Uh, use the gun, drink the drink, talk the talk, walk the walk. I am Ransom Rider. This is the Destiny Cookbook, and I'm having a fantastic time working my way through. Now, I'm going to try another sip of this, because, you know, I've made several drinks out of this, and by far, by far, this is the best one. Thumbs up on this one. Oh, well, Guardians. I'll see you in-game very soon. Bye. Bye. Thank you, Guardians. Thank you.